what's my name? Uh, my name is Sam. Where am I from? Okay, so I was born, I uh, raised in New York, but then I moved to Philly. I've been there for probably about, probably about 17 years or so. So I'm from New York, from Philly. I came with my cousin Dave. We probably left around five something in the morning, a little after five, got here around 7.30. So it wasn't, it wasn't too bad, it wasn't nobody on the road. So it was a calm trip. Why did I come? Well, honestly, like, you know, taking part uh, in the clean initiative, like me and my cousin did quite a bit ago, really impacted me in a way that was like, it's kind of hard for me to put into words. So I feel like, you know, in any way that I can pour back into this ministry, pour back into 30 mighty men, like I want to offer what I can, you feel me? Like I was up all night anyway, it's a Saturday, mans don't got work, why not come and help rebuild the community, kind of pour back, you know, what it is that I have into this ministry and, and into this place that God has uh, so wonderfully blessed these men with. It's just, it just made sense, you feel me? Yo, sorry to interrupt. Consider making contribution to this ministry by the end of this video. Your donation helps the Carpenter Sun program to purchase tools and materials and to serve more men. Any amount helps us to meet our mission of transforming individuals from fishermen to fishers of men. I right, enjoy the video. Back to it. Peace. Oh, my role today. So we've been doing a little bit of woodworking, like just cutting the wood to kind of that we're using to build the walls and the, the ceilings of the walls for the different uh, stations that are going to be put up in here. Um, and yeah, and I just kind of been watching the masters at work and doing what they tell me to do. You feel me? Marking the wood, trying to get it real precise, you know, 37 inches. And I, that's kind of how we've been coming at these guys. Are, they're, they're good at what they do, man. It, it kind of gave me like a like some extra respect for people that do this as a profession, like. I always respect the contractors and people that work well with their hands, but this is like next, like doing this every day. And actually it kind of makes me think every time I step foot in a building, I'm like, dang, somebody built this joint. Like it's, it's crazy to me, but you know, mad respect for people that do this for real. I don't know. It's kind of hard to describe. Like I'm thankful for the opportunity more so than anything. Like I'm just thankful for the fact that I can, you know, so into this ministry, like, like I said a little bit before, just in any way that I'm able to offer, you know, my time, my body, because it's, it's about more than just money. Ultimately, at the end of the day, like a lot of us, especially as men, the way we like to, you know, kind of be there for other people in the members and other members of the body of Christ in all the relationships we exist in is kind of in the way of like a monetary sort of thing. Like that's kind of how we like I can just kind of throw money at everything. But like putting forth that extra effort, like sacrificing your time, sacrificing your body, sacrificing your energy, like it kind of like it, it kind of reinforces to me that like God made me a, you know, a whole being like I'm more than just what I can provide financially. You get what I'm saying? Um, and I'm just looking for the opportunity for the most part. So, yeah, and I've, I felt good being here and it's good being amongst you know, other believers, other men, like it's just nice to be in this space. Like I know I personally, I like working with my hands and I'm kind of using this as practice a little bit because I want to be a, you know, a Bob the Builder husband for my wife when I, you know, when I get one of those. And this is good practice for that, but like, I'm just thankful for the opportunity to be a bunch amongst 30 mighty men. For Any last thoughts? Um, Honestly, man, God is good. Like, I don't need to tell y'all that y'all know it, but if you haven't heard it before, like God is good. It's not it's not just words like we say it but like you guys really don't know especially for me this year man god has been good and it's just this is this is like a small amount of like this is just as far as my response to how good god has been to me this is like the smallest that i can do right now so i'm just thankful for the opportunity for real god is really good